like the color of money. Yes, let's just get into this dress, honey. Like, ooh, hello. Hey guys, what's up? It's your girl Shanice. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, definitely make sure you hit that subscribe button down below. Turn on the bell, join the fam, join the gang because we get lit over here. So as you can see by the title of this video, I'm coming to you guys with another misguided haul. So for those who have seen my last misguided haul, y'all know I bought all of those clothes myself with my own coin. And I guess Magic Links, they see my video, misguided, they see my video, and they decided to sponsor this video today, which I'm so grateful for, so happy for. Like, honestly, look at God, like, he just came through for me. So, super excited to be partnering with Misguided on this video. I have a few gems in here for you guys, really cute looks, as well as all the links to everything will be down below, as well as my sizes. And Misguided has a lot of deals going on right now, so stay tuned for that. Be on the lookout for that, and let's just hop right into this video. Okay, guys, so we are starting off with a banger. So this is called the One Shoulder Organza Mini Dress, and I got this in a U.S. size 4. So let's just get into this dress right here. It is so freaking cute. I love the design of it. It is like this brown color, but it has like an undertone of purple, so it's giving me a deep purple with a nude lining underneath honestly the one shoulder just really caught my eye and it looks so freaking good on the model so that's what made me have to pick it up unfortunately i should have gotten a us2 or a us0 because it is really loose right here in um the boot part like my boot does not fill it out especially on this side so it's like really loose over here and it's kind of making this part look a little bit awkward at least to me i just have a zipper detail which goes on the side so i feel like it kind of elevates it to another level and this ruching right here of the organza just kind of hides any imperfections or whatnot and kind of just gives a, a different type of look so you can kind of play with it to make it how you want so yeah i think this dress is so cute like i could see myself wearing this on date night or something like that. Um, I do think I want to get a US size 2 though, just so it can fit a little bit better. This is pretty much how I would style it. Okay guys, so this is the next top right here. So this is called the black satin shirt. It's supposed to be oversized, which it is. I got this in a size US 4. I feel like for me, if I wanted it to be just a little bit longer, I could have gotten a 6 just to get away with it without wearing any shorts underneath. But with this size, I definitely have to wear shorts. But I love this top right here. It's really, really soft and silky, nice and oversized. And I would probably just... Why do I still have this in my hand? I would probably just wear it just like this, put some like biker shorts underneath or some jean shorts where you can barely even see it. Um, and yeah, this is such a vibe. And if I wanted to make it more winterized or whatever, I can wear some booties with this. I think that would look pretty bomb as well. And my little, I think these are like three inch heels, you know me, like I can't walk in heels like that or I don't like to, I don't like my feet hurting. So three and 3.5 inches, four maximum. That's it. I would definitely wear it on like date night or something. I think it's really, it's real chill, but it's also classy and nice at the same time. And then I would probably wear it with this bag right here. This is also from Misguided. I got it a while ago and I got so much compliments on it. And this is a quality bag. It looks really good, looks expensive. So love this right here. I'll probably just rock these all together. So this is a cute little look right here. I almost feel like I'm wearing like my boyfriend's button up or something. Um, that's how it feels, but I like this. Alright guys, so I got another dress. This is the ribbed blue midi dress. Um, this is more of like a teal kind of blue. So I love the design of this dress. The cutout details, I just love cutouts like that is me, that is she. But the only thing is, is that it's too big for me. Like this is a really, really stretchy dress. So you can probably go down two sizes. So I actually went down to a two. I probably could have gotten a zero just because look how much, look how stretchy it is. There's so much room in here. Like, hello. So I don't fill out this dress. I'm a petite girl. I'm small. So I definitely needed a smaller size. But other than that, I really love the design of this dress. Super, super cute and perfect for like fall, winter. It's nice and thick, nice and warm. 
long sleeve and it just gives you a little bit of sexy you know what i mean so other than the fit i do love how this looks i do have another concern just gotta put this out there so this little cutout right here you need to wear double-sided tape with it because if you don't any little movement that this will come down and your whole boob and nipples will be showing so you definitely want to make sure you wear some double-sided tape with this so it does not move around because girl so we have another one shoulder dress love 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 this one right here this is so fire so bomb so classy beautiful quality oh my gosh i'm in love with the dress like i can literally see myself wearing this to a black tie wedding on a date somewhere um, on vacation somewhere going out with my man like this is so freaking cute and so pretty like y'all can't tell me this is not pretty what i love about this dress is the fact that it has the one shoulder with the ring detail right here so that just adds a little touch to it and then also it has a little split right here so some leg action yes honey the fact that this is double lined like you don't need to wear a bra with it it kind of sucks you in real good and it's not see-through. I'm in love with this dress. It is so freaking cute. And so anyways, I'm getting too hype over this dress. I did get this in a size US 2 because I wanted it to be super form-fitting. It's not uncomfortable or anything like that. So I really love that. It's super walkable. And you can actually dance with this too. So again, I would probably style it with this black bag that I got from Misguided. Um, just to make it pop a little bit more and add a little bit of pizzazz to the outfit. So I don't know, something just like this. Okay, so this is the next item that I got. This is an oversized shirt. Very oversized, as you can see. It's super, super wide, but I really love how this looks on me. It's very my style, like super casual, but you can dress it up with some heels, and that's what I did. So, um, yeah, I got this in my normal size, which is a size US 4, and it fits perfectly on me. So, it kind of looks like a gray color, but it's more of like a very, very light lilac. So, there is purple tones in here, and... Yeah, I really like this. It's super casual, but like with some heels and whatnot, like a nice bag, you can definitely dress it up and wear this out with, you know, your girls or whatnot. Even for date night, like I would totally wear this. It does come. No, it doesn't. I thought it came with pockets, but these are just faux pockets right here, which I don't mind. Like it's not a big deal or anything. And then it does button pretty low. So I will probably keep it open like this and then wear some double-sided tape just so it can stay. Yeah, this is super, super cute. And then I think with this dress right here, I would wear it with this bag just to keep it in the nude family, kind of all just goes together. So this is what the bag looks like. It actually looks really expensive. The chain right here is gold and it's heavy, which I do really love. And then it's kind of like that slouchy material, so your bag kind of slouches, which I actually really like. It's really in right now. It also comes with this other detail right here, so you can also wear it like this if you choose to or just keep it out if you want but for now i have it tucked in there's so much room in this bag as you can see so i love it already wore it multiple times so yeah i'd probably just wear it with this outfit just like this and this just makes it a little bit more dressy um i love this yes i'm feeling this look right here okay guys so this is the next outfit right here i picked this out very unsure about it i'm just like i don't know the color is calling my name she's calling my name but the style of it and the way that it looked on the model i was just like this is gonna be this is gonna be a 50 50 right here or 25 75 but after putting it on i don't think it's bad it's definitely not really my style but i mean it's definitely not that bad like it's better than i thought it would be on the model it was baggy and it was kind of loose so i ended up going a size down you definitely have to look at the model to figure out what your size is going to be so i ended up getting a size two um and this is how it looks so i just paired it with this black bag right here as well as these boots as you can see just to kind of dress it up a little bit and because it is that utility style dress you can definitely dress it down but for me with this dress i feel like i need to dress it up so that's why i decided to wear what i'm wearing and then all the details on it are gold which obviously is like a hit for me so love that but i also love the fact that it has this tie waist right here so you can cinch yourself in as much as possible so overall it's definitely not a bad dress it's just something that i would have to think three times before wearing it you know what i mean but yeah y'all can let me know what do you think about this dress is it a yay is it a nay or is it a mm -mm 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 -mm. So 
So I ended up getting one jacket because honestly I live in Texas and I don't really need jackets too tough. So I just decided to get this one because it really stood out to me. So this is the tie waist puffer coat and I got this in this bright green color. This is like the color of money. Yes. Anyways, I don't own anything like this in my closet and I thought this was super cute and y'all, I am burning up right now. Like, I'm so hot. It's super girly because it has a little tie waist right here where you can cinch in your waist and then it kind of just flares out at the bottom. Pop your collar. So overall, I really love this puffer coat. It does come with pockets right here. Ooh, yes. And I got this in a size US4 so I definitely think it runs true to size. And this is pretty much how I would style it. And then, again, I'll probably just wear it with this bag right here. And I think this is such a look. Like, when the winter comes and it actually gets super cold here, I'm going to be wearing this. And then I love a crossbody over, like, a puffy big coat. It looks so chic. It looks bomb. It really just ties the outfit in together. So this is a look right here. So I picked up this shirt right here. It's like a mineral washed gray t-shirt. It looks very, very simple on the front, but on the back, woo! So on the back, I think it just says, welcome to the jungle, and then it has a little cute picture. So I actually got this in a size large. To me, it doesn't fit like a large. To me, this fits more like a medium. And then I just decided to pair it with these faux leather skinny jeans, which I got in the petite section. So they fit perfectly on me, like lengthwise and just all over my body. They fit nice and snug. And what I love about these faux leather pants is that they're not too shiny, so it looks real. Like, it looks good. It doesn't look like that fake shiny, that fake... You know what I'm talking about. You guys know what I'm talking about, where it just looks so shiny. It almost looks like a plastic bag. These are really nice. They're almost like a matte kind of looks matte so it looks really good with like almost anything and then it does have the silver button that's the only thing I just I don't know if I like that I wish it was like black or something that would look a lot better and then it has pockets in the back and then with this simple outfit I'll probably just wear it with these boots that I got from Misguided um, these are called the knitted panel lace up chunky ankle boots and I got this in a side of US 7 so I can wear like thick socks with it or whatnot so you know these boots are really, really in right now and I loved the style of this. It's like, it has cloth on it but it also has like the patent leather or whatever it is. So this is just a close up of the shoe so you guys can see. So this is what it looks like with the boots on, a super casual outfit. Just paired it again with this black bag. It goes with everything, cross body style. Um, and I like them a lot. They are a little bit heavy so I feel like if you walk a lot you're going to get a calf workout, you're going to get a thigh workout but I don't mind that so yeah I really like how these look and I can even see myself wearing this with like a t-shirt dress or a sweater dress and just throw these on show a little bit of skin I think that would be perfect so if I could I would probably put on this New York hat right here but I don't want to mess up my hair too much I think this would be a whole look super casual but kind of I don't know you kind of just dress it up a little bit like you look real stylish um, in something like this so yeah Y'all, I am feeling this outfit right here, okay? Feeling it. So, I didn't necessarily get these to pair together, but I was like, hmm, I got these separately. Let's try to, you know, mix textures or whatnot. And I did it, and I really, really love how it looks. This is like a super classy look, very modest, and I think it looks really good together, to be honest. Y'all can let me know if you're not feeling it, but I love it. So, I actually hold your breath. I don't really care. Um, so anyways, this is the Sage Satin Midi Skirt or Maxi Skirt, whatever you want to call it. Super, super pretty. Love the material. Got this in a size US4 and it fits actually really well and it's very, very comfortable. Like it's not tight or anything. Super loose. You can walk around, kick your feet up. Love, love, love this. And I wanted to get this because I've been wanting a skirt like this in this color for so long. So super happy that I finally got my hands on it. And then I paired it with the tuck sleeve crop roll neck jumper in white. I got this in a size US 2 and 4. So it's like in between sizes, I guess. So yeah, this is really cute. This is super, super warm. Um, I'm not really like a turtleneck girl just because it's kind of uncomfortable. But I think that they look really good on people. Like it looks 
you look really like put together i don't know i just think it looks really nice especially when you're going out places so yeah i'm in love with this and i just paired it with these clear heels which i have not um you know buckled up because i was just too lazy but i think this is a little look right here and then yeah if i want to dress it up a little bit more i can pair it with this white bag right here like if i'm going out to dinner and then if i want to make it a little bit more casual I'll just throw on this oversized bag right here um and yeah good to go Okay guys, so this is the last fit that I got. So this is called the Petite Beverly hoodie dress in a size US4. So of course I did get this from the Petite section. And I got this mainly because I love the color of it, of course. And then because it's so hard to find petite oversized dresses and sweater dresses at that. Usually it's like in the regular section and then the dress comes like all the way down here. So once I seen this, I'm like, I need to pick this up because I don't own a sweater dress like this. So definitely put that in my cart and checked out. So it does give me that varsity feel because it says Beverly Hills. It has like the little mascot on it. So love that. And I decided to pair it with, hold up, another pair of boots from Misguided. These are called the faux suede mid heel over the knee boots got these in a size 7 um, and they literally match they match so I'd probably just pair it with this black bag right here because again I like the contrast between the black and the green it just a whole vibe to me this is definitely my type of style a little bit of dressy a little bit of sporty that's me Alrighty guys, so that wraps up this misguided haul. Again, all the links and my measurements will be down below. If you have any questions, of course, leave it in the comment section. Definitely make sure you thumbs up this video so I can do more hauls for you guys. And I will see you all in the next one. I love y'all deuces.